Hey, thanks for watching Cooking with the Robinsons. I'm Sean and this is my wife, Shaylin. And we make our favorite family meals and we put them on video so that you can duplicate them at home. And take a look at these. These are gonna be incredible. This is a buffalo chicken, chicken slider. slider. Right, you had to help me with that. Bam. It's gonna be great. <laughs> Stay tuned, you don't wanna miss this. So today I'm gonna to use Sweet Baby Ray's Buffalo Wing Sauce. It's a nice, mild wing sauce that won't overpower anybody at your party, but still has a really good taste to it. Put a little bit at the bottom of the crock pot, and then I'm using four chicken breasts, and you can use however many you want. You can double the recipe. And as always, the ingredients will be in the description below. I think you'll find that you can easily get 15 sliders out of just these four chicken breasts, and possibly even more. So once you've got your chicken in the crock pot, you'll want to add in a package of Hidden Valley Ranch seasoning mix. After that, you'll simply pour in the rest of your buffalo sauce and get everything good and mixed in together. Hey, listen, if this is the kind of food you like to cook, we're doing things like this all the time for our family and putting it here on video so that you can take it back and, and cook it for yours. So be sure to subscribe and click that bell notification so we can get you many more videos just like this. Set your crock pot to low and put the lid on and instantaneously that insane rave music turns into a beautiful classical piano. For me, it usually takes somewhere between six and seven hours of slow roasting in this crock pot until your chicken is tender and pulls apart easily with a fork just like this. The main thing you wanna do now is get any large pieces of chicken shredded and incorporated back into those juices. I like to set it on warm for another 30 minutes and just let it really get infused with that goodness of that sauce. And by the way, you can make more than just sliders with this. You could also make chicken tacos. You can make a buffalo chicken pizza. The uh, options are endless. And now that the juices are fully infused in that chicken, I do recommend that you drain off a lot of the excess sauce so that you don't sog out the bottom of your bun. So now it's time to build the slider and I'm using a Hawaiian roll here and I have two options. I have ranch for people that don't like blue cheese and I have blue cheese, which is what I'm going with. I'm gonna put that on the bottom of the bun get that good and coated. And then I'm gonna take some coleslaw and it's just dry. I don't have any seasoning, no sauces on it. I will put a pinch of salt and pepper to taste. We'll put that on the bottom of the bun. That kind of helps if you do have any excess juices that are running down, again, to keep your bun from getting too soggy. Now on top of that coleslaw, we'll put our buffalo chicken. And hey, listen, if you're looking for another great recipe, we'll put a link above to a hummus recipe that will be a game changer at any party. Now make sure you bought an extra bottle of your favorite buffalo sauce. So you can pour a little bit of that back over the top of this chicken. And then I'm gonna take a little bit more of this blue cheese dressing and pour it right over the top of that and finish it off with a crisp dill pickle. Now all you gotta do is put the lid on. You're gonna take your bun, put it on the top, stab it with whatever toothpick or beautiful skewer you have, and you are ready to eat. Let's do it. Okay, so I wasn't lying. These are the easiest thing to make. Are they they really are. So simple. <laughs> Easy ingredients and just a simple and delicious meal. Why don't you take a taste of these things? And right. uh, I don't know if you're making these for the big game, if you're making them for playoff games, something us cowboy fans don't know much about. <laughs> Right? That's well, we right, enjoy watching you guys play, and that's why we try to make the best food possible. Mm. Get the most enjoyment out of it. What do you think? That is packed with flavor. That buffalo sauce. Mm -hmm. And the chicken is so tender, you can tell it's been just marinating <laughs> in those juices. <laughs> that is so good. Oh my gosh, I dropped my napkin. Sorry, you're... <laughs> that is it's the best delicious. high five. Good job, babe. Go Cowboys next year. We don't know who our coach is going to be right now. No. This is 2019. If you're watching this in the future, <laughs> these are still delicious. Doesn't matter what decade, what mm -hmm. year it is, they are going to be incredible. Make this for your big Super Bowl party. Make it for your big football watching party. Make it for whatever occasion. <laughs>